Good morning, everyone. Pastor Corey Rowan here with Yorksville First Midvale and Newport United Methodist Church. Bring your devotional today out of 2 Peter and 2 Peter 3, verse 14. He says, Therefore, beloved, while you are waiting for these things, strive to be found by him at peace without spot or blemish. And the thing that he's talking about while we're waiting for is the coming of the Lord. In fact, 2 Peter 3 talks all about the promised coming of the Lord, the coming of the Messiah, the rightful king of Israel. And so Peter is now telling the church, since you know he's coming, since you know he could come at any moment, you know, the Bible teaches what we call the imminent return of Jesus, which means it could happen at any moment. And it says, since you know this, strive to be found at peace. Peace, to be found by him at peace. And how can we be found by him at peace? Is, is if we are without spot or blemish. So be found by Jesus at perfect peace. And the peace that he's talking about is the kind of peace that only Jesus can grant because it's peace between us and God. You see, sin causes disruption in our life. Sin not only hurts our relationship to one another, but it hurts our relationship to God. We cannot be at peace with God if we're going to cling to our sins. And so that's why Paul is, or and I'm sorry, not Paul, Peter is qualifying this by saying, be at peace without spot or blemish because the only way to find that lasting peace that is needed is if we are perfectly clean and perfectly holy without spot or blemish and there's only one thing that can do that for us that is the blood of Jesus so church I want you to know today if you maybe you have not thought about it in a while or maybe you're not completely convinced about it I want you to know that the Lord is coming back not just spiritually, but he is physically coming back. He will physically rule this earth. The Bible says it could happen at any time. It could happen before I'm done with this video, and, and it could, or it could happen by the end of today or the end of the week. We don't know, but we know for a fact that he is coming. And since that's the case, then we ought to be found at peace without spot or blemish. It is not that we cannot just throw our life away sinning and serving ourselves because that has eternal consequences. If we are going to serve the king, if we are going to be found spotless and holy when he comes, then we must give our lives to Jesus and we must work for his purpose. So my message for you today is the king is coming. So be found spotless and blameless without any kind of blemish. Be found at peace. And the peace that can be found is found in the blood of Jesus. Amen.